<laughs> just the most important thing for me to be honest is to have a peaceful mind as of right now i'm actually really happy with how my body is looking i don't know i feel about my hair color <laughs> <laughs> Good morning guys, hello, happy Monday! I was literally in such a rut last week and I just couldn't bring myself to film or edit and I just feel like we're back, we're feeling good again and it just feels so good to just <laughs> You guys, I was just in such a massive rut. I don't know, I just felt so unmotivated and so flat, literally the entire week I was just off my game i don't know what happened i think it, it lasted more than a week to be honest it was like a yeah uh, about a week or so so i was like i just gave myself a break from everything <laughs> literally on one of the days i literally just read all day guys literally i read from the moment i woke up <laughs> to, the, <laughs> to the moment i went to bed um and honestly i felt like i needed that it felt good and now we're ready to <laughs> smash out this week and we're ready to go we're ready to get going anyways i'm ready for work i'm just wearing crop top some joggers with my um cute led to the house slippers it's literally the old elite 11 i love elite 11 i don't know if you guys can tell already but i do love elite 11 like their clothing is just top notch especially when they're on sale can't help myself um yeah literally i only buy things that are on sale <laughs> from them because i really don't think it's worth spending that much money on things that are full price anyways regardless that's just my personal opinion we love good sale <laughs> i don't know how much i'm gonna film but i might just film a few days i don't know if it's gonna be a weekly vlog but we'll just go with it we'll just go with the flow I really don't want to put too much pressure on myself and I don't want to overdo it and then burn myself out like I did. I feel like I have burnt myself out like to the crisp, guys. Like, I think I pushed myself a little bit too much. <laughs> Just lost the fun in my life, I'm gonna be honest. So I'm trying to do things that I find fun, like reading. I love reading, especially fiction books, specifically romance that just speaks to my heart and to my soul. <laughs> So yeah, I've been incorporating more fun things that I like to do into my routine as much as I can so I can, you know, stay lively and happy. But yeah, okay, I'm gonna get ready, you know, for work. I'll talk to you guys when I can. Cheers. Mm. The wasabi's not spicy. Oh, yeah. We have three different wasabis and none of them are spicy. It's not good enough. Mmm. 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 Well, how that went up my nose. I put too much. Mmm. 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 That's the kick you want, huh? I don't know how I feel about my haircut. I kind of look young, like a young mom, but no, it's not too bad. I kind of like it actually. I didn't show you guys when I got my haircut, but this is how it looks like. It's not too bad. I actually kind of like it. <gasps> I'm on my way to the gym. Just taking some oxy, sh oxy short. Yum. Mm. Anyways, let's go, gym.
fun breakfast. I'm sorry it's a bit dark at the moment. Like, how's that? Yes, okay, hello guys. So at the moment, uh, oh my god, I can't breathe, I don't know why. My training split is two lower body days and two upper body days. And today is my lower body day. I'm taking out the of course. I'm going to be filming on my phone because I feel like it's much easier to do so. And actually there is a time limit at my gym at the moment. I can only train for 45 minutes. I'm gonna go now so I can get in before I have to line up because we also have to line up at the gym, you know, because <laughs> there's a lot of people wanting to also work out at the gym. And yeah, I really just don't want to wait in line, so I'm trying to get in before peak. So let's go, ladies and gents. I'll see you at the gym. Mm. <laughs> Hello, guys. Mates to the gym. Yes. Sorry. Sorry, babes. Um, I always look forward to drinking my Oxy Shred. Like, this is the reason why I get so excited to go work out because of my Oxy Shred. I'm so excited. Mm. I'm sorry if this is in the way, but just just embrace it. But yeah, I'm just finishing this up. I took a lot longer than I thought to drink it, but here we go. Cheers, let's just chug it right now. <coughs> let's go to the gym. I won't be filming on my camera I'll be filming on my phone because it takes too long to set up and everything on my camera so that's that airpods check apple watch check <laughs> there we go because we have my life in this bag okay bye <laughs> So nice and sunny, it was so warm, and now it's as just you know, like a bucket of water just falling from the sky right now. And I think I'll be stuck in the car for a while. Cool, <laughs> amazing. Anyways, um, okay, so I want to update you guys on my current health and fitness goals, I guess you just you could say. And as of right now, I am still in my muscle building phase. And I am not exactly tracking my calories and macros at the moment. I'm trying to get back to having a healthy relationship with food. So I did have a chat with my coach Marie about, I don't know, like a few weeks ago to a month ago. And we both agreed that it's best for me and my mental health to just focus more on getting enough nutrient dense foods and whole foods into my diet rather than tracking every single thing she just wants me to track protein and make sure that i'm getting enough protein protein in daily and that's what i've been doing and it feels so good it feels kind of very liberating to not track my calories or anything like that as of right now i'm actually really happy with how my body is looking i'm very comfortable with how much it's growing and you know I am storing a bit of fat and that's honestly fine it's kind of, it's just literally normal it's okay because I am eating more food and I am I'm at this place in my life where I'm just very content I guess you could say I'm very content with how I'm eating how I'm training and how I'm looking and I don't know it's just really nice I just feel so at ease and I feel like my mind is just at peace it's just the most important thing for me to be honest is to have a peaceful mind wow i don't know if you guys can hear the rain but it's really 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 strong right now so yeah i'm sorry if you guys can hear the rain there's nothing i can do about it but yeah i'm just so happy because i've just i've developed a healthier relationship with food because i felt like i was kind of going backwards a little bit 
the last couple of months like I was feeling very restricted and I was becoming food focused and all that and it just it was driving me insane and I'm so glad that I had a chat with Marie to kind of realign what I wanted to prioritize which was obviously my mental health and to just be good here <laughs> my mind is more important than you know trying to get like a certain physique goal so yeah that's just where I'm at right now just a little update but yeah I'm just really happy with you know where I'm at and you know I'm content and yeah just glad to let you guys know so yeah that's that I don't know if I want to r risk running through that rain right now <laughs> pardon me I meant to get my period today but she a bit late but I'm still feeling the effects of being on your period because I just felt kind of tired during that session at the gym but that's okay I just kind of tried to go through all the exercises and do what I can to the best of my ability today and I did I'm proud of myself got to celebrate the small wins I'm celebrating the fact that I did go to the gym today and still got it done even though you know I'm not feeling like at my peak yeah okay So I'm prepping my lunch for tomorrow, look at that. Some may say that's overcooked, but I think that's just crispy. Oh yeah. You know, depending on my mood, I do like it crispy and sometimes I like it literally just right, but this is what we're going for tomorrow. I'm also having salmon for dinner tonight. This is already pre-made. I'm just gonna microwave it, I think. Oh, I'm gonna chuck it in the air fryer for a little bit, but yeah. Good stuff. <laughs> I'm obsessed with salmon, guys. Like, literally, I'm not even kidding. So here we have it. We have <laughs> our tomorrow's lunch. Made some guacamole. This isn't for the salmon. This is for the grass-fed beef mince that I made the other day already. Since I was already cooking up today, I might as well just make the guacamole now instead of tomorrow. And then Thursday's lunch right here. I cut up some pineapple because I've been craving pineapple. I'm gonna share this with my sister. I'm so excited. And this is my dinner. Not just that, guys, don't worry. I got some strawberries to snack on. And we have some more salmon here that we need to cook up. Because I love salmon. But yeah, that's the go, I guess, for the next couple of days. Salmon, burrito bowl. Literally been obsessed. I've been having it every single week for the past <laughs> month. <laughs> I don't know, it just it tastes so good. Like oh, yum. But yeah. That took me about two hours. Literally, meal prepping takes me so long, even though it's kind of like really basic stuff. I don't really like to put too much effort into my meals because I'm kind of lazy, but I also want my food to taste good, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's that. And then I'll probably have like oats every day. I've been really into oats lately. Or Vegemite, eggs on toast, rotate. You know, it really just depends on my mood. But when I'm at work, I just have oats because it's just easy to just chuck in the microwave and eat while I'm working so yeah because I'm going to be working for the next two days so it's easier to just meal prep everything today for the next couple of days so we're set and I don't need to worry about it don't need to stress about what I'm going to eat and we're good <laughs> so good I'm so excited guys I'm coming back slow 